Namaste. Hi everyone. Esther here once again speaking to you. I'm very happy to be before you once again. Thank you for letting me into your space and I wish you a joyous listening. Today I want to talk to us about um, motivating yourself. You know, being able to buckle your shoe straps and keep moving on into the direction of your dreams. In other words, take responsibility for your growth, take responsibility for your happiness, take responsibility for the things you want to do, and take responsibility for the choices you make. You know, the good thing is we have all these potentials at our disposal. We are able to do all these things. We don't require anyone from outside us to motivate us, to help us make choices, or do advice is one thing, but it's down to you to take if you are being advised. You know, it is our responsibility. You know, you can't even truly grow if you do not take responsibility. Even those things we call mistakes, mistakes are part of the process of growth, okay? Do not beat up on yourself because you think you made one mistake. If you've been going within, as I've been talking about going within, to find answers to questions, you will find out that in the midst of those mistakes you called, in the midst of those actions you took that you believe were mistakes, something great came out of it. It could have taken your journey onto another path altogether. It could have taken you in, onto another direction that you never thought of. And another thing is that you must have learned something else. You must have learned something in the process of doing the wrong thing, as you put it, a mistake, something that has been very valuable to you. Let's talk about character. A lot of times, the best of our character comes out from when we fall into a ditch that we don't know how to get out of. It may keep us humble enough to cry out. It may keep us brave enough to try. It may keep us discover who we truly are as in our potentials to do it by ourselves and thereby noticing how strong you are and how powerful you are. So these labels, they sort of hinder us. But when we look at them in the face, we begin to know that all these things are there to empower us. I know it's hard for you to believe that all the adversities in your life, all what you've been through, that difficult parenting, that difficult marriage, that difficult financial situation, that difficult career path, you, you just name it, put yourself in those, in those gaps. They have all been part of the great plan. The one that created you had all of this in place to bring you to the better side of yourself. Okay? A lot of times we come through adversities stronger, better, wiser, and even happier. That is why some people are able to give back by telling you. Some people who have been through stuff, like myself, I can be able to tell you that they didn't come to you to kill you. Those difficult times, they came for a purpose. That difficult child is there to teach you. That difficult marriage that you, 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 one day you think of moving away from, the next day you think of bringing down heaven for your spouse, it's all part of the plan. You are learning in the course of all those. So I am hammering on these issues because I know that one thing in life that is permanent is change. You will never be in the same place every time. And the only way you will find true happiness and fulfillment is when you move from one stage to the other. That's the excitement that life has to offer. If you don't go along with this flow of change, one stage, one level of your life to another, 
and you are stagnant, you will never be happy. You will never be happy. Ask people who think they're truly happy. They will tell you the excitement is in the new desire. Yes. The excitement is in the new desire. That which you desire further from where you truly are. It's what makes life. And yes, it comes with contrast. It comes with contrast. That new desire is created in the contrast. Because you felt that, is this all there is? I think there is more. Like myself, I always have that thought. I always believe that there is more. If you have arrived at a certain level of your life that you think, this is it. You're fooling yourself. There is still more. There is always more. Growth and change are those two things. You cannot separate them. So it's up to you as you want to grow as a person. Remember, it is not just for you. It is not just for you. I am a strong believer in raising children with values. Let them know what truly is important. You don't impose them on, you don't impose these things on them, but you let them know. You let them know. You, they let, you let them see you operating with values. And they will know, ah, this is something very important. Like being able to become better. Being able to become better so that you can be able to help some other person. And you know what? Becoming better is not just for you. Like I said before, especially for your own children, your own surrounding, your own. If you have that mind of making your world a better place, you'll be challenged to become better because that change will start from you. You can't change anybody. You do not. You can't even try it. It starts with you. And when it starts with you, you become successful in different areas. Gradually, it affects the next person and the next person and the next person. This becomes like a, like a snowball. The more you, the further you roll it, the bigger it gets. That is how life works. Anything you've ever received, anything you ever know, you can never keep it to yourself. You can never keep it to yourself. So I urge everyone, wherever you are at, start from there. There are resources. The other day my child told me, Mommy, you always say I should change, but you don't tell me how. I told her, I've been telling you so many times that uh, resources. You have your mobile phone in your hands. You as a child, you can use your mobile phone to go on YouTube and learn new recipes. If you want to keep healthy, you will find a lot of healthy recipes you can try for yourself and keep healthy if you want to start anything there are a lot of free tools online that goes back to you a lot of free tools make sure you use your time profitably if you cannot invest in a bigger education to learn new skills i will urge you to not spend your time online doing nothing you can entertain yourself, you can laugh, you can, but purposefully search, go on Google, go on YouTube, search those things that you want to develop yourself on and you will find free tools to help you start to learn. And if you are truly serious about learning new things, there are mentors, people who have been down that road who have come onto the other side and they know what you want to know and they are where you want to be because that's what they do now. Mentors are those ones who have gone up there and they want to give back. And to be honest with you, we all are mentors. We all have something to give back. We all know something and have something and are something. We, we, there's nobody who's empty. So my plea is that we begin to see how to reinvent ourselves, getting better. If you are doing something that you truly love, work at getting better at it. If you know somebody who needs what you truly need, give them the idea, but don't impose it on them. Guys, I will continue the discussion in another video. I wish you a very lovely day. 
that's my little bit for you today motivate yourself there are resources take responsibility take everything there is to take even risks life itself is risk okay but make sure you grow make sure you don't stay in the same place if you are watching this video on youtube if you have not subscribed yet to this channel more beautiful and uplifting content is coming up do subscribe this might be beneficial to some people share with them and together we are going to make this world a better place as you seek to become the better version of yourself i seek to become the better version of myself together our world is going to be a better place guys look up for more videos much love from me take care talk to you in the next video bye bye